Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Louisville, Kentucky, with the frauditor that has been going by the name of News Now Dumbwaiter, or at least that's what a lot of us in the community have begun to call this idiot. At any rate, he, uh, he decides to go down to the local city hall, and he ends up getting booted out. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Let's just try it. You ready to go? It was, I'm suing you. You're on notice. You're being sued, Jonathan. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. You ready, Tiff? Can you all go first? We don't like cops walking behind us. Please. I don't want you walking behind me. Dude, I ain't, I've been through this. You're the one armed. I've been through the scanner. Go on. Go on, man. I'm a free man. Go. By the way, I had to edit his video down to pro manageable size because they're normally an hour or more long. And who wants to sit through all his belly aching and everything like that? But but at any rate, this guy wants to file some more lawsuits. I mean, come on, dude. It's going to cost you so much more money to do that. I mean, you still haven't even successfully sued anybody who uh, has been making fun of you, so uh, how's that going to work out for you? Wait behind you? I got the same rights as you, brother. You better stay the f*** way back, man, where you can't... Cop, the Louisville cops can only shoot about eight feet anyway, so stay nine feet back. Somebody else grab the door. Come on. Watch the step. So the government protects itself. Oh, look at you smirking. This whole face. You think it's funny? Because you're the one going to pay for this in the end. You'll be the one named. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Nice to meet you. We're going to help. With, well, this will help. Man, oh man, with all these frivolous lawsuits you've been filing, I just wonder how you have time to go to work and do your job that you say you've been uh, missing out on because of, uh, well, us uh, anti-frauditors. I mean, especially since you've been blaming us with your other contracts being lost. I mean, but you know, I guess if you are truly unemployed, you'll have time to file those lawsuits anyway, if you have enough money to do so. But we shall see how those turn out. I mean, eventually, uh, the, it'll all come to light. Yeah, a lot of stuff all day. You're kind of wasting our time. I don't no, think I'm not. Important. Three times a day, I try. You know what I'm saying? Right. And I need this record now, you know what I'm saying? Because I got harmed yesterday. So you know what that does? How did you get harmed? I was stuck in the elevator, man. That's not hard. That's Locked in. Right, you gonna follow What's that? Did you get his address? Okay. I was just talking to him. Hey, man, this is a public lobby. Jeez. I can't even stand around and talk to a cop in a public area these days. Do you think that you're escorting me out of here or no? Like, did you, do you think you just resolved the situation by making me leave? I didn't yes make or no? Leave, I just asked you. Right. No, I'm asking you. Do you feel like you made me leave? I think you need to address it with the city manager. If I go back in, you going to come in behind me? Oh, my goodness, dude. Uh, are you that really that stupid? I mean, people have explained it to you over and over again that that elevator was key carded and uh, couldn't go up to the next floors without the proper key card. And you could get out of that elevator just by pressing the button one. So you weren't detained in there. You were just too damn stupid to figure it out. Excuse me, guys. Pardon me. Sorry, man. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Excuse me, sir. Don't touch me. Hey, why are you touching me? Because they're standing in the you're doorway. You're getting ready to get charged with assault three. No, you're getting ready to get charged. You're touching me. Say something. Guys, hold on. I'm going to report a crime. He's walking. So I can get out of the way. He's walking in a public area. Come on. You know what that is? We're trying to exit. You're trying to push my office. Because I got something else to say to one of the guys. Where can we stand out here? This is public. Can we not move out here? No. I was not trespassing here. You got no right to do Can that. Not walk forward? I did nothing. I was doing? standing here. You bumped into me. You're impeding. Intentionally. You saw me here and you bumped into me. To you are kind of intentionally aggravating the situation. Right. Will you make him move? Right. Make, make him move. 
Oh, yeah. It makes perfect logical sense for the very officers that were sent to boot you out of there to uh, let you back in there. Dude, it doesn't work like that. I mean, good freaking grief. There's more of them than there are of you. Do you think you can intimidate the, all of them to let you back in there? No, not going to happen. Make you move. You're the boss. Make you move. 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 Don't do this. He I just told you, it. move forward. Move forward. Mother you are breaking the law. Do we need that type of language? Nobody you know what? You. When you guys are Nobody challenged, you. when you guys are challenged, when you know somebody's breaking the law right in front of you, and the person keeps on doing it right in front of you after command after command after command, lawfully, what do you do? Sir, I've told you the director said this is a restricted area. It's but it's not. The director said that up to that magnetometer. He also said that after you leave, they're going to shut the door. This ain't the magnetometer. This is the entry to the building. I think you're arguing the wrong Make person. You him take it up move. The city, not me. Make him move. No. I'm walking in and I won't pass the magnetometer. No. Listen, officers, this guy is a 20 year law scholar. He knows everything about the law. Oh, wait, that's Chile de Castro. And he still doesn't know anything. This guy is much worse, though. But let's go ahead and carry on and see how well it works out for this constitutional law scholar. They've asked you to leave. They said it's not an area where you can just wander around. We've asked you to leave. You keep intentionally trying to escalate you the situation me to, leave? to do something. You asked me to leave? The director. The director did not ask me to leave. They wanted you to leave. The director did not ask me to leave. Well, you know what? If the director You're out of line. Leave, they probably should have asked the director me. did not ask me to leave. What are you laughing about? All right. He can't. He knows better. He knows he'll get in trouble he for it. He doesn't even know the job. You should know that. No, I'm going right here. Right, and you soliciting is illegal too. Dude, get off me, man. Hey, stop. No, tell him to quit stop. pushing on me, man. That's assault, man. You bumped into me, so that's assault three. No, you stand in the knee grass. Play the game. I can be here. You are impeding someone's progress. Get man, you're a ignorant tyrant. Double. Is this place open for the public? Is it open to the public? We are closing the door and we'll open the door. Is it open to the public? We are closing the door and we'll screen people at the door. There you go. Hey, you are making a difference. Because of your stupidity, you're making it harder for everybody else to get in there. So congratulations. You did it. You made a change. Good for you. Now give yourself a good old pat on the back for your accomplishments. Can you please leave me? So they're closing now? Yeah. Nice trick. Nice trick. That's the only legal excuse. It's a loophole. It was a dumbass move. You can call the air No, I'm gonna call your boss and I'm gonna and this dude here, you're getting fired. Excuse me. More than you'll ever have is family. I don't run it. You don't need a YouTube. Nobody will like you. You wouldn't get a YouTube. You won't even get a follower on Facebook unless they're bootlickers. But don't say you're a media professional after you run a YouTube channel. Oh, poor baby. What? You don't work for local media. I don't. You media. I do. Okay. What is that? None business. Tyrant. Yeah, listen to your boss. Since you started to use profanity, direct the I'm not asking you questions. I don't know why you're so They're officers. What? Oh, would you say you're leaving? No, you are leaving because y'all are dismissed. Right here. Go. Get out of here! Go on, you tired. Get the f out of here. Matter of fact, leave Louisville. We're tired of cops like you. Excuse me. Profanity Yeah, I'm using profanity. You're letting him break the law on me, man. Well, we all know why he got kicked out because he's an arrogant douchebag who thinks that he knows everything. But that's not the part we really wanted to see. We want to see him getting kicked out. And that is the fun part. And guess what? Nobody likes a smart ass, so try to remember that from this point on, but uh, I guess you won't. At any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.